Okay, so today I'm going to do something I haven't really done before, and that's do a, uh, a mod on my Les Paul. Um, I wanted to try doing uh, what's called the Peter Green mod, and uh, it involves taking this uh, neck pickup, kind of loosening up the screws on the inside, taking the magnet out of the middle, flipping it over, putting it back in. And so uh, when you do that, you play in that middle position, these two pickups are now out of phase with one another, kind of like those in-between positions on a Strat. And so it uh, can produce some unique sounds, uh, definitely different. So uh, we're going to try it and see what it sounds like. So I'm going to play a little bit uh, pre-mod, uh, and then I'm going to do it. And we're just going to see what happens. And uh, it's reversible, uh, as long as it don't break anything. And uh, so, yeah, so here's what it sounds like pre-mod. The wind's blowing. Okay, so I uh, finished that up, and uh, I'm just really surprised at uh, the results. I've never listened to Peter Green. I've only read about the mod. I've never really listened to a lot of people um, who use this mod, uh, except maybe uh, Greg Koch. I knew he had the uh, the Greg Martin Les Paul that had the Greeny mod. Uh, so anyway, here's what that sounds like. I'm boosting it. I've got the uh, radial elevator set up with a big clean boost. Uh, running into the Iridium in a Bluesbreaker pedal, uh, and it sounds really good. Uh, I'm just amazed at the difference when switching from the middle to the bridge or to the uh, the neck, um, and especially even then switching to the neck and finger picking. It's loud and cl much cleaner sounding, uh, of course, than strumming in the middle. So here's kind of what that sounds like.
Yeah, all you gotta do is like touch that volume knob and that phase cancellation goes out the window. Roll it back to like nine and it just comes rushing in, real thick sound. So uh, really cool. Uh, I think there's gonna be a lot of use for it um, and I'm excited to play around with it. And uh, yeah, it's easily reversible. Uh, I should have uh, maybe You never know what you're going to have when you live with kids. But now we have a nice background soundtrack. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, I guess I'm done. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Uh, hope you learned something. I know I did. Um, yeah, thanks.